One of the last things in the world you want to see in a survival situation is your phone telling you that you're out of power. Uh, that means, without a doubt, you can't call for help. But they now sell these portable USB chargers that you can keep in your survival kit and load with a couple of batteries. So as long as the cell network is within range and still working, you can call 911. I wanted to see what I could do by opening one of these up and seeing if I could modify it. Basically, it's a USB port that's powered by a couple of AA batteries that you put inside. There's a disclaimer not to mix batteries or let children swallow batteries. And basically, this whole thing is just put together with friction. I've already opened it up previously. And here's the part I hope to modify and explore. I've labeled the plus and the minus, uh, so I'll know which is which. I'm just going to use a couple of cheapo batteries that came with a uh, remote control. I guess there's zinc oxide. I originally had planned on using some of my survival keychains duct tape. Uh, however, to keep this tidy, uh, I think I'm going to leave this intact, my uh, duct tape in my chapstick container, and instead I'm just going to use old clear tape. So this is what I've put together after just kind of about 10 minutes of a kludgy attempt at doing this. This is just an experiment to see if this will fit. I'm not actually going to use this device. But we have the two batteries, the USB charger. I'm using the duct tape just as a spacer to keep things in the center here. A couple of uh, popsicle sticks, a paper clip bent at the bottom to conduct electricity so that you have a continuous uh, in-series circuit. Uh, so it all fits in a, in a uh, little tic-tac box. My cell phone is very low power, only 5% left on its little bar graph. And let's see if this emergency charger works. It works. So I'd say this was a success. Uh, there's still enough room in there. I think I could even fit a solar panel in there, uh, but I don't think I'm going to develop this any further. It was just sort of an experiment to see if this could be done, and my conclusion is, yes, it can. Here's a combination product. It's a solar panel rechargeable NICAD battery battery charger glow fob. I don't know what to call it. Solar panel, solar battery, re uh, I can't even think of what to call it. Solar rechargeable NICAD AAA battery uh, glow fob. 
plus it's a cell phone charger. Now here it's a combination product. It's a solar powered uh, rechargeable glow fob plus it's also a battery uh, cell phone emergency charger to charge your phone.